G'day, this drum video is for Ruby by 21 Pilots. There's definitely room for interpretation between the recorded version and the live version. I'll focus mostly on the recorded version, but if you love their live stuff, then check it out and see if you can work out exactly what's going on. Anyway guys, let's hop on the kit and I'll show you what I've done. The first groove when the drums come in goes like this. There's definitely two different hi-hat sounds in the recording, so it makes it a little bit tricky to play it exactly like the recording. But when I checked out how Josh plays it live, he definitely does that 16th note pattern with his right hand, but then he also moves his right hand over to the snare drum for those two quick snares in a row. So you can muck around with that too if you want to. At the end of that, there's a bit of a stop and it goes like this. After that stop, another snare drum sound gets introduced. So once again, I don't know that you would necessarily play this live, but you can add in a couple of those extra drags just so you catch a bit of that marching snare while you're still playing the beat. Altogether, it would sound like this. Then we move on and we've got this little marching snare drum pattern that pops up again and again in the song. So I'm going to play the first two notes on the toms and then we've got this little marching thing that goes like this. We use those same sections again, and then the next thing we need to look at is when the drums build up right before we drop down into nothing at the bridge. So this is the big build up, I'll play it for you now. Everything gets quite spacey for a while, and then when we come back in, we're just going to have some offbeat hi-hats right before we add in some toms. So that will go like this. And then the tom section goes something like this. If you feel like you want a challenge in that section, we could definitely get those offbeat hi-hats happening with the left foot. And that would sound like this. At the very end of that tom section, we just build up on the floor tom and then we have a snare drum at the end. Then we're into our up-tempo groove once again with those kicks driving along. It's pretty straightforward and it goes like this.
then there's a really roomy, dirty drum sound for the next section, which is up on the crash cymbal playing a really similar rock beat to the beginning. That little snare fill at the end just has a drag at the front, which is two quick doubles right before you come down with your right hand to play the rest of the 16th notes on the snare drum. Then we're back into our tom and marching snare bit, so that just goes like this, and this is going to be the end of the song. And there we go, hopefully that's helped you out playing Ruby by 21 Pilots. As always with their songs, there's a bunch of different sounds, so it's up to you which ones you leave in and which ones you leave out. Happy practicing guys, I'll catch you at the next lesson.